Yes, Britt, I got here around 5.30 yesterday morning, and the scene was just truly eerie with the black smoke in the sky and the flames. I could feel the heat on my body. I was at a loss for words, but I got to speak with a key eyewitness, and after speaking with her, she was on the verge of tears, and what she has to say left me speechless. Just listen to her story. So however the air was blowing or whatever, it wasn't engulfing us. It was over us and aside of us. Marilyn Ott says seeing this up close felt like a movie. A massive car accident early Wednesday morning on I-26. The entire scene replays over and over again in her head. Uh, first thing I did actually when I did see the flames, I mean, I just prayed that everybody would be okay. I mean, I just prayed that God's hand would be on it and I saw his hand. He protected everybody in it. Um, the ones that were walking on my side of the interstate without a scratch. What's even more unbelievable for Marilyn, she's not normally on the road that early in the morning. She was on her way home from dropping friends off at the airport. She says she was almost there when she saw this. It was a harrowing experience seeing all that black cloud of smoke and over you. That's when it felt like it was in a movie. You know, you're like, this is unreal, and, and which was really interesting. I didn't smell smoke. I didn't smell gasoline at that time. It wasn't until much later that we smelled the gasoline. This charred 18-wheeler is what's left of the tanker carrying that fuel. 8,500 gallons that flipped over and exploded. That's one of 10 vehicles involved here. Um, you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say everybody was emotional. It was amazingly how calm everybody was. But as remarkable as it was, everybody remembering, wow, you know, how did I get out of there? And I got out of there so quick and it just boom, boom, boom. Even Marilyn can't believe she got out of there. And it was, I never even took a picture. I just thought about the people around me, you know, just, you know, do you realize how good God is in all of this? It, it was a miracle. I, I don't know what else he can call it. Before the interview started, as I was walking into her home, she was wiping her tears with tissue and I said, you know, what's wrong? She goes, it's not sad tears, it's happy tears. She says, from this experience, she's learned that she has to thank God every day for her blessings and that you never know what could happen if you're on your way to work or wherever you go. Reporting live off of Fernandina Road, I'm Destiny Chance. Watch Fox News.